hello there welcome back to my youtube channel my name is abisola so today i'll be showing you how to make this tasty nigerian fried rice if you're a first time viewer thank you very much for clicking on this video please subscribe if you're a returning subscriber thank you very much for coming back so let's get started and you know the usual thing don't forget to comment don't forget to share don't forget to like so let's get into this <music> I am going to be using long grain rice and I'm going to parboil it with chicken stock, seasoning cubes, thyme, curry and salt. So um, I'm going to leave this to boil for a while. When I'm done parboiling it, then you guys will see the outcome. And then I've added sliced rodo, what, which is called scotch bonnet. So I'm going to put this aside before I continue with my other things for this fried rice so i put veggie oil inside this pan and i'm going to be adding sweet corn green bean carrots green peas and spring onions i'm going to fry it stay fry not fry stay fry it we don't want the rice to get spot on time that's why you end up seeing people's rice getting this everybody will say nigerian fried rice ah, fried rice is voila fried rice has its own issues fried rice gets spot easily but when you stir fry your veggies before you cook before you finish cooking your fried rice it helps to prevent to preserve it a bit so make sure you stir fry your fried rice the next time you are making it so i've done stir frying my fried rice now so if you've watched this video to this point that means you enjoyed this please subscribe to my channel thank you then the next thing is i'm going to fry these onions and i'm going to fry it in a way that i won't let it get burnt till it is translucent so i'm going to keep stirring it again you have to do a lot of stirring because you don't want to get some of your veggies and your other ingredients burnt so now i've added green bell pepper red bell pepper so we're going to keep stir frying this can you see my fried rice is coming together Hmm. I can Im you can imagine how the whole thing is looking colorful. Was, ah, oh my god, it looks like Christmas already. It smells like Christmas already. So now you add our rice is parboiled, well done. So uh, you are going to add your rice into the fried onions, red pepper, pepper and green bell pepper. So if you want me to show you how I cut my peppers and my veggies, drop a comment in the comment section, and I'm going to do that in my next videos or a video that is coming after i'm going to do that specially because i don't want to waste too much of time on this ingredients and you can actually buy your veggies in supermarkets around you you can buy them in supermarkets around you you can order them online i know some online pages that sell veggies if you don't want to go through the stress of cutting them but some people prefer to do that there's at home and i don't see anything wrong in it if you have the time so i'm going to add my add, uh, fried veggies to it after adding my rice you can see i'm turning it together and that is all and your fried rice is ready so fried rice is not something that should be so complicated and all so now i've added fried liver liver chunks i've added it to it you can buy liver in any market around you boil it fry it and they cut it into chunks and you can add it you can put sausage but me i don't really like sausage in my fried rice like that so that is the outcome of my fried rice and you can see that this is a very simple recipe to just carry out it's very simple and easy to do and your christmas is made merry christmas and happy new year in advance i love you guys and i wish you a very very merry and <laughs> nice christmas merry christmas guys bye